<clears throat> All right. Hey, you guys. It's your girl, the Empress 555. I'm trying to crank these videos out. I got to go to the dentist. So, let's crank it out. Um, I think I need to do an oracle message, <laughs> you know, for the karmics and uh, the angel card for the karmics for December. Um, you already know your girl is in the building. I mean, spirit is in the building. Um, so, let's see. Angel card for the karmic. Angel card for the karmic. Okay. Hold on, spirit. I just saw discernment. Okay. Angel card for the karmic. Angel card for the karmic. Please and thank you, spirit. Angel card in the car for the karmic. Please and thank you, spirit. Okay, you gave me more than enough. Okay. Forgiveness. Forgiveness is the first step toward letting go of hurt and emotional pain. It only heals you. Um, the karmic is definitely in a vindictive manner right now. Um, they need to forgive themselves as well as forgive others, okay? Because when you don't forgive others, you keep yourself in a stuck situation. And that is exactly what's going on with this karmic. She's stuck because she can't forgive things that have happened in childhood. She can't forgive things that happened or he can't forgive things that have happened in different relationships. She can't forgive the masculine right now. Um, so she's stuck. That's, you know, I heard that only if she will forgive and learn how to do it with a forgiving heart, this masculine in her could possibly work out. But she has no gratitude. She has no forgiveness about herself. She has no anything about herself. And that's not being divine. And so spirit is saying, no, you can't have my child. Gratitude. Pray for what you need. Be grateful for what you have received already. She does not... She, or he, you know, they're not grateful. They're not, they don't have any gratitude. It's like more, 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 give me more, give me more. It's, it's never enough. And that's what's going on with her because she's never had, or he's never had, um, the spirit of discernment to know that I'm, I should be grateful to, 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 as I say this, I should be grateful no matter what. Okay. Um, like somebody always owe this person something intentions okay intention is the great power that fulfills our dreams as your will so is your destiny her intentions have been all the way wrong his intentions have been all the way wrong this person's intentions have been evil has been undeniably um unfair to other people and she never goes in it or he never, this person never goes in it with good intentions. They, that's why it's hard for them to forgive. It's hard for them to open up their heart. It's hard for them to do a lot of things because they don't have good intentions. They never have good intentions into anything. That's why the relationship between the masculine and this karmic failed. Self-fulfilling prophecy. Take small steps to diminish your worry. Okay. No, it is going to be okay. And so it is. So spirit is trying to comfort this person because let's be real. This is that spirit's child, you know, so spirit is trying to comfort this person. Let them know you need to take the small steps to diminish all of these things that that don't fit you. You need to do the necessary work in order to um, have gratitude, forgiveness and have good intentions toward people. And then you will see the outcome change. Look how this person is in here balled up balled up you see that this person's balled up because you have you had bad intentions you don't do people right 404 as i say that okay so we're gonna take this deck right away deck and we're gonna see what's up what's going on karmic for um december the beginning of december I think I'm going to do one card for each or let's see. We're going to do forgiveness. Forgiveness. What does the karmic need to for? What's this forgiveness card about? Okay. Forgiveness. Mm. Forgiveness. Uh-huh. <sighs> this karmic needs to forgive herself because... She keeps herself in a mental conflict. I mean, mental confusion. 
in conflict with others. She's done a lot of people wrong, and it's, it's weighing heavy on her conscience right now because she was being selfish, and now it has caught it, it caught up with her. You know, you're not being good and fair to other people. It caught up to you, and she wants forgiveness for doing something um, toward this masculine. Yeah, having another lover, and it's eating her conscience up, making her sad. Mm hmm. What else? Does she, what's this forgiveness about? Yeah. She's been communicating with some type of spirit guides. I don't feel like it's the positive side of the spirit guides. I feel like it's a negative guide that she's been, yeah, that's been holding up things for her, making her wait for things longer because she's not doing the, the necessary. Yeah, look, she needs forgiveness because she is... <sighs> She wants victory so bad that she has done a lot of things to get it. Breadcrumb people, stole people happiness, and juggling. So she really needs forgiveness for the things that she's done in life. Yeah. She wants forgiveness because she really did hurt somebody that loved her. That gave her everything. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And she's asking for forgiveness. She needs forgiveness as well because she's been stopping some, some opportunities for this masculine to come his way. Yeah. King of Cups. This masculine is about to take the leap of faith and she wants forgiveness for it because she knows it's a missed opportunity now. Yeah, she knows that all of her cheating back and forth in this relationship with the third parties, she's had plenty of third parties. And she knows that this person is ready to take action on someone else right now. And she wants to be forgiven or she needs to ask for forgiveness because she's being a bitch right now. Yeah, she's being very defensive right now. She's been spying on this man all in his business as well as dibbling in his money. Yeah, she's been messing with his money. Okay. Whew, self-fulfilling prophecy. Take the small steps to diminish worry. Know it will be okay, and so it is. What does she need to know about this karmic for, for the December read? Hmm. Who? She's very worried about this King of Swords. Yeah, she knows that judgment is being called on her. The relationship has diminished, definitely. Okay. And the spirit is saying, just know that this is this is that person's justice to start a new beginning because of what you've done. And that's why you're in a mental prison. But know that you're going to be okay. Yeah, you're in conflict and confused. You're still starting conflict, okay? Spirit says you're still starting that conflict. But just know that it'll be okay. But this is a part of your judgment in December. Yeah, look at this. She's being blocked off by somebody and money. No job, no nothing. She's tight on money. Yeah, but this is all a part of her karma. Because she's been messing with high priestesses, messing with magic. And guess what? It's about to be an unexpected tower. Somebody's about to leave and go on their journey. And this is all a part of her karma. And Spirit's saying, yeah, the, the self-fulfilling prophecy is, is that, yeah, I'm making somebody take small steps to to lead their life the way they need to go because you've been doing so much see so much secretive stuff and building so many illusions. So now I'm creating with somebody that was a past life soulmate to you um to leave you. But this is a this is a karmic soulmate. That's why this is diminishing, okay? Intentions. 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 What is this intention for um, December? Please, the the beginning of December, please and thank you, Spirit. What is this intention? Yeah, she's intending to have a lot of sex. That's the only intentions that she has. That's her dream. She likes to have sex, and. Her intentions is to make this masculine fall for her through sex. Yeah. She want to move things. She want to move fast. 
And I'm also seeing that this is police. Like her intentions is to have a new beginning. And her passion is to put this person in jail. Yeah, she's very defensive. Yeah. December's intentions. Yeah, confusion in the household. She doesn't want this person to be happy. She's going to cause this person to lose a lot of opportunities. Ooh, she is going to stop this person's rebirth by any by any means necessary. She's going to do it. Yeah, she's keeping this person stuck. And those are her intentions. Yeah, she's waiting for this person to come in with some money. She's waiting on this person to get more money. This is the truth is what I'm, I'm hearing. Yeah, and she's secretly um, having a love affair with another woman. That's her intentions. Um, intentions on, I just saw uh, the Page of Cups. I think this person is going to try to have another child to keep this person around because the first child wasn't his, but he believes that it's his. But she's going to have this second child to make sure that it's his so she can get some money from this person. Doggy dog world out here, baby. About some money. Yeah. She's going to stab this person in the back constantly because she, she, she loves hurting this person. She loves to see this person sad because she can't conquer this person's spirit. So she's going to constantly keep hurting your person, y'all. Okay. Whew. Gratitude. <laughs> Come on, last one. Those are her intentions for December. Gratitude for the beginning of December. Gratitude. All right. What's the gratitude, please? And thank you, Spirit. A cycle is ending because she's not showing gratitude. She's not praying, or he's not praying. They're not grateful, and the cycle is about to end with somebody that they're working with. Look at this a 10 and the world card, baby. It's over, over. Spirit says, Since you cannot show me gratitude, forgiveness, have great intentions, and be a self uh, fulfilling prophecy, guess what? I'm going to end everything. Everything that you had, you're going to lose because you're not showing me gratitude. Look, spirit is pulling back from that person and making other people pull back from her too. Look, pull back some money. Spirit said, I'm going to make the, the whole family dynamic end. I'm going to make everything end because you're sitting around and you're not being grateful for what you got. Hmm. Yeah, what? I can't make it up. Going to make a... a um, a king of wands move away from your ass, okay? And then what he gonna do? Block your ass when he do because he he's he's losing too much dealing with you. And then this man gonna go from the king of wands to the emperor. No, you better know what's going on. That's the harsh truth. Spirit said you got some harsh coming to you because you're not showing me gratitude. Spirit don't play that. Spirit so so I suggest you get into hermit mode and go in within and listen to me. Spirit is not playing. Because this new beginning is going to go to a queen of wands that's worthy. Because she showed gratitude. She's going to get the happiness. She's going to get the success. She's going to get the new stable beginning. She's going to get the, because she's, she's going to get the beauty and everything. And she's going to get a new beginning. Possibly with a baby. Planting new events. Planting um new seeds. Planting um jobs careers everything you're gonna get it because you show gratitude collective and she didn't she's gonna be stuck while you having a rebirth why she's being conflicted about judgment that spirit is showing her because she's been lied to i mean she's been lying and being deceptive so the tower got to come down because you have no gratitude and somebody's going to move on from you and somebody's going to offer somebody else something. Yeah. And it's going to be long-term stability. And all you're going to have is a new beginning with the devil. Because you don't have any gratitude. And because you want to act like you were delusional. And you don't know what's really going on. Okay. Spirit is not playing. Spirit said, I'm ending it. Some of these people may even come into death. Okay. Or people may be dying around them. Uh, because they have no gratitude. Okay. 
All right, you guys, that's all I have for right now. I love you guys. Until we meet again, peace.